are they doing? Yeah, I see them too. Oh my god. I think Painter's dead. Oh, look, a fish. Luigi. Um, Luigi. Oh. New friends. Okay, guys. Um, seriously, this is the bathtub. This is not the beach, Goku. You can fry an egg later. Come on, guys. We have work to do. The kids are waiting. Painter. Uh. Are you breathing? Oh, boy. Hi everybody, and we are on episode three. Today I'm going to show you how to make a new friend. We're doing a um, underwater theme for the next couple of days. So as you see, I have some octopuses. They're really, really cool. If you have a toilet paper roll, I know we kind of have a toilet paper shortage, but if you have a roll, this is what you can do with them. It's a lot of fun. All right, so first take any color crayon you like, and you're gonna color the whole thing. Oops, well, make sure not to lose them. Oh, I upset him. There we go. And you're just gonna color the whole roll. Oh, look, we have a helper. I should get her a box of crayons. Oh, I better not be boring. She just yawned at me. Oh my goodness, she yawned at me. All right. So get it colored in as best you want, just like that with a crayon. All right, next. We're going to decorate them. So. If you have a Sharpie or any type of marker, you're going to draw a face. Make sure it has eyes, of course. And I like to make mine kind of goofy. This guy's looking cross-eyed. I'm going to give him a nice, silly, smiley face. Let's have his tongue coming out. Oh my goodness. Some spit. Ew. Give him some big lips. Oh my goodness, he's funny. Don't forget some eyebrows. All right. And if you want to add some extra detail around him, you can. Some, maybe some squiggles. Maybe some dots, big circles, triangles, whatever you want. Okay, now next, you may have to have an adult help you. Now, how many legs does an octopus have, right? Eight, right? That's right, you knew that. So what we're going to do is we're going to cut the bottom like this. See how I did that? So this is going to be our first leg. After we have this leg, what you're going to do is you're going to curl it upwards like this. See how I'm doing that? So it's a curl. And when you let it go, look at that. Cute little tentacle, right? Okay. And do it all the way around. Now make sure you're going to have eight tentacles at the end. So far we have three. If they're all not the same size, that's okay. Four, five, six, 
seven and eight. Alright, so look at that, eight tentacles, and look, he sets up in everything, it's really cool. Now, if you want to look at my other examples, look at that, they actually have little suction cups that I drew on, so if you want, have fun and do that, draw them on the bottom. You can use markers, sharpies. Anything you want. They're really, really cool. Oh, look. My name. Yeah, put your name on the back. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed that activity. Next up, we're going to be drawing more undersea creatures. See you then. I got to go rescue my friends in the bathtub. Yeah. They're goofballs. <sighs> what am I going to do with you guys? I know, it's not the beach. Told them that. Hey kids, and welcome to the bonus feature for episode 3. So, we have a toilet paper shortage you don't have toilet paper here's something fun you can do just with paper and your friends your brother your sister your mom aunt uncle whoever stuck at home with you because we're all stuck at home all right so you have a plain sheet of paper crayons you're set in the middle of your paper you can draw your silly face However you want. Don't forget maybe some spit. It's always fun. There we go. All right. So there's my silly face. There he is. Okay. Now, just color it in. Use some different colors here. Got some purple too. Oh, maybe a blue tongue. Yeah. Make them interesting. Okay. After you're done that, you can shade in carefully around his eyes and his mouth. If you gave him a nose, you know, color around that too. And you can make him whatever color you want. Can be rainbows. He can be a green. He can be purple, red. He can be black, gray, whatever colors you want. I might add some red to this. So that makes him pretty cool. Yeah, well, that's really neat. Add some texture. There we go. Do some cross hatching. There we go. Remember, we learned how to do this in the second video. Oh no, Luigi fell down. Our photographer is down. So glad he didn't land on that fish. Yeah, look at that. All right, now take a look at this. I have rolled it all the way, add some tape, my tape is stuck, I got it, okay, put some tape there, 
And don't use too much. Just need two pieces. Put some there. Look at that. We have a jumbo. All right. And the same as before, you're going to cut eight legs and you're going to roll them up. Roll it up. And let it go. Ooh, look at that. Make sure he has eight. Rolling, 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 roll it up. Yeah. Three, four, woohoo. Five, six, seven, eight. Just roll them up. And remember, on the inside, you can draw those little circles for his little suction cups. Oh, I have an extra. Just get rid of that. Roll it up, roll it up. Do, do, do. Sing a little song to yourself while you're rolling. Oh, look at that. That is super cool. You have a jumbo octopus. He's really, really cool. You know. Oh. Guess I'm the photographer now. <laughs> Enjoy, kids.